Hi everyone! I'm so grateful that I'm given this opportunity to discuss with you some relevant topics and information about science education. It is true indeed that the teachers like you here in the Republic of the Philippines is very much needed because you will be serving as instrument in producing students that will be beneficial to the society and to our culture as well. You are the great force that would influence students in becoming scientifically, technologically, and environmentally literate. I am Ms. Janelaine Pinglobatan, a former grade school coordinator in Athens. Hi everybody, my name is John Ribi Montinola, teacher 2 from Bungahin Elementary School. I am really very grateful for these international seminars conducted uh, to us by PSAA. What are my insights in this uh, seminar conducted? Of course, it would probably strengthen me as a person, as a professional. Um, I believe that it is my responsibility to improve myself to be a better teacher, not just for myself, but also to my students. Uh, 21st century learning is a really a challenging task given to us teachers. As a teacher, I believe that it is our moral obligation to teach our students to be holistic, not just to be a man and a woman of intellect, but also those individual uh, Anchored with values um, and scientific skills that they need for them to compete. I know that they are really trying their best to um, change our curriculum in order that our students, learners will be globally competitive. I am hoping that all the things that you have learned in this seminar, particularly all the pedagogies, the content from the, from the curriculum and how you could be able to manage, manipulate, and make the curriculum relevant and responsive into the lives of the students for sure that you would be able to have a great impact into their lives. I'm calling all the participants, my colleagues, science, even uh, different uh, subject teachers, that it is our time now to reach out our students because we Filipinos were ranked seven out of the Asian nation and we know Filipinos are resilient and third and very creative and innovative. In terms of our speaker, first we have our speaker from Indonesia. Um, I think she represented a well Southeast Asian culture of a typical Southeast Asian um, individual. I think the resilient of the passion to share her knowledge to us is, is amazing. The Akrashi, the commitment, they already have. What is different with women? We're going to put in mind our devotion uh, that we're going to work this in one vision one nation while uh, dr. Jacob is is amazing it's the sense of humor is there um, also the passion to share is is there so please don't be afraid to explore some of the creative ideas that you could possibly use in responding to the needs of your learners and we are hoping that you could be able to influence other teachers as well to become more efficient more effective and to really develop the skills necessary for our students to become globally competitive and for the PCAA thank you so much for the extent planning of your international um, seminars, especially in science. So again, I would like to, to thank PACAE in organizing these training workshops for our friends here in Bacolod area. And we're hoping that we could have 
more of this training again in this place and also in other parts of the Philippines so that all together we could be able to build a nation that with citizens that are relevant to the society. To P-A-C-A-E. It is a great uh, pleasure and privilege to us here in Negros that at last an international seminar was conducted here. We've been waiting for this one, we've been praying for this one, and finally, yes, it is in, in Negros. And hopefully, um, it will not be the last time that you would conduct and sponsor an international seminar to help us teachers and of course other professionals to enhance our capabilities and knowledge in the field of teaching. Madamoy na salamat, kagsaliwat, palangga kamunamon diri sa negros.